Oh, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we did it. We opened Oko. No, just kidding. It's a uh, Castle Lock Dwayne. What's Oko going for now? Jesus. Why is that relevant? What did you say? Why is it relevant? Yeah. Why is it relevant? Yeah. I don't know. I'm just curious. Oh, it's only down to 50. Wow, I wonder if people are like, this dude's fucking done. Drop it. Drop your Oko's fast. <clears throat> He's got to get a ban, right? I wrote an article. My article's coming out on Cool Stuff tomorrow. Probably yesterday by the time this is up and um if you haven't seen the results of this weekend it's utterly ridiculous my article's going over oko over this past weekend and it's fucking insane is it called why oko is no joko no that's a good title though what should we take here man what's the pick you like sir alan the lion's claw i like these okay these are the two i like Oh, if they said we know it's a problem, that dude's done. That dude is absolutely gone. I, all right, I'll take Sir Allen. Would you say Sir Allen or... Yeah, it's Sir Allen, sure. Sure, Michael, I'll take it, okay? You don't have to be like this. A little Halloween fun that I stole from the internet. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. What's happening? Why is this so large? a large image, my dude. Let's make it regular size. It is spooky, my skelet- is skeleton spelled wrong? Should there be another E here? What's a skeleton? <clears throat> I think you misspelled your meme. I like this ogre or rant. Errant? Errant or a rant? Hmm. <clears throat> Melissa and Paul said they were keeping an eye on it during last night's Wizard of the Coast stream, yeah. so probably feeding it at the price dropping. Yeah, maybe. I stole it. Okay, well, that's fine. Oh, Searing Barrage is Skeleton. Nice. Whale food. Hmm. It's like plankton. Skeleton. Hmm. And that's why I never know. As B. My name is Michael B. Skeleton John is my favorite singer. Hmm. I love Skeleton John, actually. That dude's great. <clears throat> you big Skeleton John fan? Oh, yeah. Oh, Thank yeah. You. Hold me closer, tiny skeleton. <laughs> Count the bones on the highway. The bones? <laughs> Count the bones on the highway? This is just 2 2 flyer for two, right? That's pretty good, right? How to keep an eye on Oko. Watch any competitive magic deck in any format. Wow. Yeah, so basically, if for those who don't know, go check out my article on Cool Stuff Inc. It'll go up tomorrow on Wednesday, my dudes. Oko was there were two copies of Oko in the vintage challenge deck this past weekend that won. There were two copies of Oko in the sideboard of the legacy deck that won the the legacy challenge. Um, there were like twenty copies of Oko in the in the standard classic. Of course, he won the thing. Uh, there were four copies of Oko in the pioneer deck that won the pioneer challenge, and there were. Oko didn't win any of the modern events. There was a modern classic and a modern open, both of them this past weekend. But there were five, four copies of of Oko decks in both top eights, and they came in second in both events. So that's literally every format: vintage, legacy, modern, and standard, and the pioneer, pioneer, which isn't even a real format yet. Uh, and Oko was dominant in all, literally all of them, and it was probably like it's it's un, it's just an unbelievable amount of Okos. Did I just take another Burning Yard trainer? I don't know, man. God, you don't know anything. Take a fairy. Oh, oh! Mysterious. Two mysterious path lighters is just so nice. Then you play any adventure creature and you're just like, put two counters on it. Especially if you can get a bunch of these jobbies. Oh, wow! The first time we get an on-color knight. Or one of these, one of these dudes. When we're not like, you know what, I don't know if it's the first time, but it's still nice. Knights. Must be knights. Oh, seven dwarfs. Alright, we're taking this. Maybe the other one comes back? Probably not. But the point is, like, what do you do? Do you ban Oko in just standard? Because it's still, like, it's pretty un... I think it's unprecedented that a, a mythic planeswalker, any, any card, really, I guess it doesn't have to be a mythic planeswalker, was present in a winning vintage deck, a winning legacy deck, a winning pioneer deck, a winning standard deck, and second place in two modern, de two modern events. That's six events. 
Yeah, it's pretty insane. One planes, one card was in all six of those events. I just don't like. It just seems unbelievable. Like I don't understand what you do there because do you ban him from like all formats. <coughs> Oh, wow. Oh, wow. That was great. Oh, all right. Man, this is working out pretty well. Skull Clam could have gotten there if they didn't emergency ban it, I think. Wow. Yeah, that's probably true. <laughs> But it's still legal in Vintage, and it doesn't show up in Vintage decks as a thing, like... Wicked Wolf. <clears throat> oh, biscuits. I think we just take this thing. Oh man, Wicked Wolf is so good. I don't think it's worth anything though. No. <clears throat> you can just tell you're like, nah, it ain't worth nothing. That's just a regular card. Seventy tickets. Wow, that'd be amazing. It's so good though. Wow, it's not even like sort of half play. a penny. Yeah, it's not even like close. That's crazy. It's literally three cents. Okay. I think we just take the Ardenvale lady. Yeah. Oh, Lily Moon. This guy's good. I'll take this guy. Come on, give me more dwarves. More dwarves in this piece. If the plus one can only target your permanence, holy crap, it's such a different card. What are you saying in this piece? If you only target your own stuff, that would make him a lot different. It's a totally different card. Oh, Ogre Rant's good. All four of these are great. It's a real shame I'm not in green. Look at all these knights, though. Weirdly enough, if you can only target your own stuff, you might be unplayable. I don't think... No, definitely not unplayable. Definitely not as strong. But, like, the fact that you can negate any artifact, any artifact, Ensnaring Bridge, Crucible of Worlds, <clears throat> like, you name an artifact, Lodestone Golem, like, all these artifacts that are super relevant, Null Rod, like, they're all just negated by a, by a one Oko. It's just a card that does so many things. Like, it gives you threats, it negates your opponent's artifacts and creatures, it gives you food, which is life. In the Urza deck, it makes 1-1s one -ones for you. Or, uh, yeah, artifacts, rather, so you can tap them for mana with Urza. Like, it's just pretty insane. Like, it's not even, like, a... It's not even a real magic card, I don't think. I think it's a fake magic card. Oh, man, give me these seven dwarves. If that other seven dwarves comes back, we get four. Oh. Seven dwarves, seven dwarves, seven dwarves. <coughs> oh, man, shutting off a worm coil engine with an Oko is just utterly unbelievable. Jeez. You're just like, <clears throat> what's that, a 6-6 six, six with lifelink and death touch and it makes twos and it dies? No, that's a 3-3 three, three now. Those are just stupid and brawl. Literally makes your opponent's commander pointless if it's a creature. Oh, yeah, that's true. Spaghetti Toucher, thank you for letting me know I can have seven seven dwarves. I was just saying we would, we've would we seen four so far, and if the other one comes back, we'll have all four of the ones we've seen. I was not saying four as in, like, the maximum number of magic cards you can have in a deck. <clears throat> Happily ever after, Michael? Is that what you want to be? Do you, no. want, do you want to be happily ever after? Is that what you want, Michael? Michael, are you not? Are you? No. Oh, okay. <clears throat> oh, Michael B. He lives in the trees. Our deck's looking pretty good so far. Yeah, put your put your beautiful glasses on. Glass slipper. <laughs> what? Glass slipper? Mm -hmm. I thought you said glassy boy. I don't understand how you could play any number of games with Oko in testing and not be like, wow, this card's really good. 
Like, like, I'm, hey, I'm having a hard time beating this card. What should we do? Oh, another barge in, huh? Come on, seven dwarves, you come back. Does Mike B's trash can stay up in the trees like a dirty treehouse? Yes. Kind of. <clears throat> Tonos, I have... I have a confession. I actually am terrible at choosing charities. And I was getting... I was actually getting some level of anxiety from having to pick, and I felt really bad. Because it's kind of a big deal, but, like, I've never had to pick a charity before, which is really weird. Like, most of the times, the charities are already chosen. Oh, man, I didn't get that. That Seven Dwarf didn't come back. Can they change the wording on a card? Uh, that's called errata, and usually they don't do that because it's very hard to keep track of and no one has a good time. Uh, Scorching Dragonfire is just better than Seven Dwarves, right? Yeah. Well, Biscuits. Yee. Yeah. Well, I did put the shout out on Twitter, so as soon as you choose one... Okay, I'm gonna, I'll choose one tonight after my stream if that works for you. Or some, rather. Do you just want me to choose one? How many do you want me to choose? Yeah, I thought it was up to three. <clears throat> oh, I like Shepherd of the Flock. Shepherd of the Fluke? Yeah, Shepherd of the Fluke. It's a... Nice. Nice. Oh, everyone else just chose one. Alright, I'll choose one then. Yeah, I think choosing one is probably easier. Because if you have four people choosing three each, then you have like 12 charities. Oh god, is it Sir Kara? Or is it Opportunistic Dragon? One's got float. Send it to the boat. What to the boat? Send it to the boat. That's not what you said. Float. It's not like you said send it to the boat. Yeah, send it to the boat. No, you said send it to the boat. I didn't say that, man. You're crazy. Can we roll back the videotape? You know, it's all recorded, right, Michael? No. I actually don't know. I don't. I think Dragon's fine, but I also think this card's bonkers. Really? Do you know what it does? He doesn't. He has no idea what it does. He just picked one card without knowing what both, card, what both cards do. It doesn't seem that great. What? It deals one damage to any target, so that's that's great by itself. It's a it's a pinger, but then like if you shoot them, you get to draw a free card. I guess. I think it's this one. You guess? I don't understand what you mean. What is that? Like I'd rather just take a four three flyer. That'll get the job done. Instead of like journaling with a pinger. Uh, I mean, you can put on the restricted list in Vintage, but there's no restricted list for other formats. Vintage is the only format with a restricted list, and it always has been. <clears throat> and the reason is that Vintage is a format that lets you play all of your cards, um, so they don't ban anything. And the reason is you... That's not why. Until you choose one, may I put the American Cancer Society? Yes, that is totally fine. I think that's a good one. Wow, you're really, really living your best life, Mitchell. I know it. I'm really proud of you. Are you? No. 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 No, no proud. No. 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 Oh. What are you doing? What? What are you doing? What are you talking about? I'm talking about what you're doing. A thing happened. Zeb, thank you so much for the resub, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome <clears throat> back. Oh, take a number, number four. I definitely don't wish they would do Restricted in Legacy. Restricted is just a bad time. I think in theory, Restricted sounds great, but in practice, Restricted just means uh, the person to draw their one Restricted card first is doing better. Like, <clears throat> I 
Oh, another Ardenvale Tactician. That's nice. I'm pretty sure if you have Restricted in, in Legacy, like, the thing is, like, you're either gonna, the card's either going to be unplayable or everyone is going to just skew their deck around um, trying to find that one card. Like, because you just put the card either in an unplayable territory or everyone just plays one tutor. Like, because then you have, like, one on the sideboard and you'll play, like, four <clears throat> living... No, I guess... Is there an enchantment tutor? I don't know. There probably is. Doing a little day drinking? Are You are? I don't drink at all, so... I'm not. I'm doing... A, I'm, I'm day drinking some water. So that's... You know, that's cool. What did you say? The reason is you? Mm-hmm. Hmm. Why do I have 27 cards here? Because you're stupid. Shit. Yeah. Well, that sucks. I don't even know. You probably cut the glass zipper. The glass zipper? Mm-hmm. Watch so much YouTube content. Has remember to come back and show the appreciate. Thank you so much. I really do appreciate it, man. And uh, the second part of Outer Worlds is going up on Wednesday, my dudes. So I'm going to actually have them go up on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So three a week. Michael B. Go back to your tree. How did I get three Ardenvale Tacticians? That's pretty nuts. I have a lot of creatures in this deck. 21 is a bit much. It's a bit much. I want to take this fairy guide mother out. I think she's fine, and we like having two mysterious path lighters. Maybe we don't, though. I could literally just take out all four seven dwarves. That seems bad, though. Well, you either play four or you play none. I think that is what it comes down to, yeah. <clears throat> is it worth full price? Yeah, for sure. You think four dwarves is too few? Wow. It's messed up. It's not seven, to be fair. What about that guy? Yeah, okay. guys can go. It's only three cuts, though. Good lord. No, only two. Yeah, Slipper can go, I guess. Two? You want to do 41? I was just going to play 16 lands. What? We have three five. We have four five drops. Five five drops. You get there. You got a problem, man. I don't think Slipper's as good as you think it is. You guys don't like Unicorn? Unicorn's a 5-5 five -five with the two Mysterious Pathfinders. That's eh, fine, I guess. Oh, I like that. That's nice. I am in Florida. I, I The only Magic players I need are the Magic players on MTG Arena and MTG MTG Online. MTGO and MTGA. Truth Serum Mike B. Which of the seven doors would you say Frank is and Frank vice versa? Uh, sleepy, 100%. Not close. Yeah, it's not really close. <clears throat> uh, he'd be the one that's stupid. Which one is that? Stupid. Stupidy. You have seven dwarves to pick, and you can't pick a good. You can't pick a remember, real dwarf. I don't remember the dwarves, man. They're sleepy, dopey. So you're dopey. There you go. Wow. Yeah, I picked one of the two. I remembered. <laughs> oh God. How hard was that? It's dopey, my dude. Eight eight done. <clears throat> All right, let's do this. Let's run it out. Teen Treb. Take out Fo Fox is not in here. There's no Fox in the deck. Is Surly a dwarf? I don't think there's a Surly. Michael B. Yes. Hmm. 
I'll keep it. <coughs> Got him. Okay, you look really beautiful with your glasses on. Thank you. You're a designer. You <laughs> you have really nice eyes. That's me. That's me too. That's you. What if we just did a whole stream like this and that was just how big your head was? <laughs> like, we can't see the cards and I'm like, I don't know what I'm going to do. I can't make his head smaller. Valtrex, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome, Backles. <clears throat> that is some nightmare fuel. Interesting. Oh, double mysterious path lighter, huh? We're going to be lighting some paths. Some lighting some dudes up. Light it up. Light it up. Alright, we're lighting lighting them less up because of they killed my guy, but... Oh, this is by Unicorn. Oh, I was very much... But, but, better Unicorns like it. This one is by... How much donation to, to, to do that stream? <laughs> $1,500. One Mike Big Head stream, $1,500. I feel like I'm pricing people out at that rate. Or you're pricing people in. What does that mean? No, it's only $1,500. That's not quite out of realistic range enough for some of the people <laughs> <laughs> That's true. Oh, this guy's a real piece of work, isn't he? What about accumul accumulative? That's not even a word. Sure it is. Accumulative. Is this fighting? Uh, yes. Okay. Ooh, so what we can do is tap a both of these dudes and then do nothing, I guess. Huh, I don't like that. Yeah, t t <laughs> Oh my god. You people are ridiculous. They have two cards in hand. I'm just gonna hit this dude. Actually, do I just wait? Yeah, just tap him. No. Yeah, but then I don't do anything like... This costs five mana, dude. If I tap him this turn, I can't do anything else with my mana. That seems bad. I'd rather just kill this guy now. What's the Deech on the charity event? Oh my goodness. There you go, Thanos. I was like, come on. He just entered this. Don't be ridiculous. Okay, so. There's just no point to even tap these guys, right? I'll just make it a... Three, four, floaty boy. I was a floaty boy once. What happened? I fell. You fell? Yeah. I don't get it. I flew too high. Just picked up this bat little fell after several months of searching. Oh, that looks nice. Also, 65 bones is a steal. Maybe. I mean... I just think, any, uh, you know, any nice watch that you like for that price is good. How old is this? It, like, needs new battery. And you're like, yeah, that's fine. <clears throat> Sweet Michael B's. Michael B. lives in the trees. It says, oh, that's funny because it says right in the, uh, it says right in the description, wear on leather strap needs a new battery. I'm not sure what he's talking about. Maybe that's why he's selling it. He's like, it doesn't work anymore. I probably just need a battery. I don't feel like dealing with it, so.
Oh man, look at that Lost Legion. I had a watch from the Walmart that I really liked, but it broke and they no longer sell it. Sammy, could you just find the same watch online? USSR battery equals unprocessed uranium. Yikes. Well, they have no good attacks here, which is great for us. I like having no good attacks. <laughs> like having no good attacks? Don't talk to me anymore. It's Don't weird. talk to me or my son ever again. <clears throat> you don't even have a son. Buddy, I have a son, all right. Uh, son of a son. Another turn. Now you son of a son. Son of a son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> son of a son of a bitch. Wow, that's amazing. Okay, so we're going to deal like a sh sh butt ton of shmamage. All these guys are getting in there. Boom, 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 ba da da ba da da ba da 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 Four and one. <coughs> that seems fine. I have to have you on mute because uh, I have students in my room, and you and Mike type out all your banter and your play moves. Thanks in advance for being so accommodating. Oh, yeah, anytime, man. For sure. I'll totally do that. <clears throat> I'll take four. Let's draw something good. It's not going to be one seven dwarves, right? That would be terrible. That's actually pretty good. Statistically, there's a good chance it was a seven dwarves. That's true. So here's the thing. Well, that's unfortunate. Makes me look real dumb now for not playing this guy first, but... <sighs> what can you do? I don't buy stuff that you wear online. I need to try stuff. Yeah, I do that too, though. But I buy like six things from Amazon and then I just return the ones I don't want. <clears throat> so I'll go to Amazon and I'll buy like eight pairs of jeans. And then I'll be like, all right, I like these three. And then I'll return the rest. You okay? Mm hmm. Are you sure? Who knows, man? No one. Literally no one. <laughs> I think you're. I think you're, uh. I don't know, man. I think you're one God's gift to, to the world, I think. Scry, too. Fascinating. That's worse than a seven dwarves. So you got a three here? Oh, you're going to gain. So you, go, you stay at six? Sounds good. What'd they do here? Put two on the bottom? One on top and one on the bottom. Okay. Let's see what they drew. One, two, three, four, five. I mean, it's eight lands is a lot when we've drawn eight spells, eight lands. What if those glasses were like the monster masks from Goosebumps and fused with Mike's face? That would be amazing. That's kind of all I want. That's all you want? Yeah. That's all you want out of life? That's it? Well, not out of life, but out of our friendship, yeah. I just want those glasses to fuse with your face. Would that really matter? Yeah, kind of. Why? Why not? It is spooky, my skeletons. <laughs> why? Well, I mean, why would it matter? They'd be glasses that were fused to your face. Yeah, but like, so what? Amazing. So what? Yeah. What do you mean, so what? Spooky, scary skeletons and shivers down Mike's spine. 
I guess we take six here and then we hope we don't die. I feel like maybe our barge in should have been used should have been used as just like a trick and then we could have been <clears throat> winning this game my dudes are they gonna foreboding fruit us that would be gas well i think we have died they tap a guy down then they tap another guy down and then we have one blocker and then we die <sighs> that's, that's true that's sad I had a sad. Michael B. How you doing, man? Hmm? That's what I thought. Uh, you still playing the GPs of Pair for Magic? Not really, no. Gyps. I could care less about GPs. This is like extremely local. Even then, I'm like, eh. Wow. <clears throat> Look at this cat using this toilet, man. That's crazy. What a time to be alive. I still want you to come back to GP Las Vegas. I mean, I'm not opposed to that because that event would be more fun with friends than it would be like competitive magic. Michael B lives in a tree. That's the way it's Michael B. Yeah, Michael B. Wait, there's competitive magic at GP's? Nice. Oh, come on. Give me just one red mana. Come on, Michael. Come on, Michael. But uh, I gotta do it? You son of a... Oh, God, I hate you. Hold up. We... Wow. This is how we die. Just a one mana, dude. What? He's just a one mana dude. What yeah. the? What does that mean? What's a one mana? We'll be fine. We got time. What does what you said mean? We got time. It's just a one mana dude means we have time. Mm-hmm. Okay, maybe not. Okay, but what does it's just a one mana dude mean? That's all you have to worry about. This is a two mana dude. Oh. It looked like one mana from a distance. A distance? <laughs> These glasses aren't really great How for visual. How far are you? These glasses aren't really great. Oh, God. For that kind of stuff. These glasses aren't really great for, you know, like, looking at things and stuff. Yeah, it's almost like they're joke glasses with no actual vision improvement capabilities. They have the opposite effect, actually. Yeah, who would have thought? Do I just block here? God, that feels bad. This is a two for one if they if they sack this guy, so. Oh. Cool. That's cool. <sighs> fun close game. match, close match. Fun game. Okay. This could be a good hand if it, you know, if this we. This could be a good ham. No one said ham. I did. Steamed hams. 
my dudes. <laughs> yes, steamed ham, my dudes. You want to see my trebuchet? Yeah, sure. All right, it's right here. Okay. Thanks for looking at it. You're welcome. Really, you're gonna show up a turn late. You okay? I'm exploding. I can hear it. Do you eventually have red mana? <laughs> do you? Uh, uh, you do eventually have a uh, red mana in your in your red white deck. Hello. I really do hate that man. You know Jurassic Park? No. You What's will. What's that? It's a movie. What's it about? Two dinosaurs making love. <laughs> <laughs> that is not what it's about. Buddy, I guarantee you that's what it's about. You guarantee it, huh? Am I going to like the way I look? I guarantee it. How many dwarves do we get? Only four. Four dwarves, isn't it? I don't know what that means. Is that a saying? Wow, you're just killing all my things. Look at you. Look at you with your efficient things. Drawing a lot of fucking lands with this deck, huh? So what you're saying is the other games we didn't draw any lands. This game's we're drawing all the lands. And game one, I would argue that we drew uh, an excessive amount of lands as well. Oh, baby. I love it. Do you? No. Okay, well. Well, they're just killing everything, aren't they? Yes. Well. They're still at 15 and we're at 20, so joke's on them. Heh heh heh. Heh 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 Sure. I'm to just kill this guy, to be honest with you. Oh yeah. Dwarf it up. up. Now they're gonna regret getting rid of this trebuchet. Check it out. <laughs> wow. It is mutual, my dudes. God damn it, stop doing that. They're just killing all my dwarves, so now they don't I guess they don't regret it. There we go. Amazing. Wow. God, that's just incredible. That's oh, just boy. This guy's got haste. Do I just smash in there for three? Probably. Why would you not? Because he can give another knight plus two plus two, but that's a lot of waiting. It is spooky, my skeletons. No way. This is not my best work. Are you kidding? I would say this is one of your masterpieces. I mean, you could probably Photoshop it a little better, but... Oh, you think this is Photoshop? This looks like MS Paint to me, my dudes. Oh, maybe. They have two cards in hand? Well, they've they've literally dealt with every single thing without playing anything but a smitten swordsmith. So if this burning yard trainer just goes the distance, I'll be quite proud. How much mana you tap in here, my dude? Six mana, huh? Seven mana stolen by the Fey. <sighs> <laughs> Another land. Sounds good. Eight lands. One, two, three, four, five, seven spells. Cool. So they just block with three. Yeah, now I don't have a reason to play this. I'd rather just get the bonus out of it. Would that frog also be late to work? Probably. <laughs> oh. Michael, Michael, Michael. <clears throat> wow. They're like, I'm going to keep two of my fairies back. Night. Land. Sounds good. It is the rhythm of the night land. Whoa. The rhythm of the night land? Yeah. Yeah. Burning Yard Trainer. Burning Yard Trainer. 
burning on the storm. Burn, 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 burn. Unto this mutual born. And boom, 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 boom. Moochels on the storm. You okay? <clears throat> yeah, man. Moochels on the storm. It's our, it's a, uh, the door song. You know the doors? No. Who's that? My dad. Wow, another third reef soul. Must be nice. I wouldn't know. Because all you've drawn is literally removal, 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 uh, bomb rare. So, it's hard to, it's hard to really, to really tell what it's like to, to really draw the cards that we need game. No one knows what you're doing right now. Literally no one. No one has That's any idea said. what you're doing. No. 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 Said. No. Mm-hmm. Let me guess, Reef Soul? Oh, Charm Sleep. Seems good. Huh. Seven doors. Absolutely worse. Ten lands. We've drawn ten lands. <laughs> yep, seems good. Remember that time where all they drawn was removal and then they drew uh, Charm Sleep in addition to all the removal they drew? Oh, look, they're not even like holding the dupe. They're like, no way, I'm just getting in there before I draw another, my 11th land. That's good. Thank you. I'm sure this will get the job done and won't be countered immediately. I'm sure this will get the job done and won't be destroyed immediately. Hold on, Reef Soul is a sorcery, so probably gonna have to wait till they're. Oh no, they got a uh, baked into pie, so that's nice. Yep. All right. Cool. Wait, okay, it's okay. We drew another land, guys. Baked into a pie. That's a cool song. It's a little fruit pie. It is a little fruit pie. Yeah. Uh, I was a fan of the franchise up until Terminator 2. T2. Judgment Day. And then I was like, eh. Everything after was kind of like, eh. But I don't dislike the franchise, if that if that means. Mike, anything. do you have a favorite type of pie? I'm a big fan of sweet potato pie. No, you're not. I've never seen you a sweet potato pie I in your life. I also like pumpkin pie. This bitch has never eaten. And sweet I also potato. like pecan pie. I've never ha I've never seen him have a slice of pecan pie or sweet potato pie. It doesn't mean I don't like it, man. I've known you for like ten fucking years. You think you'd eat one slice of those in my presence in that long, man? I just don't usually buy pies. I just show up where pies are and then eat them. I ain't never seen you show up where a pecan pie or a or a sweet potato pie my ever is. My parents often have those pies. Oh, do they? I also like key lime pie. That I've seen you eat. Okay, there you go. You feel better now? No, because you just made up like three pies. I didn't make up no pies. Make you sound all... They make me sound southern and cultured. Just because I didn't buy no pies recently. You mean recently in the past 10 years, the past decade of your life? Look, man, I like pie, okay? What does that mean? <laughs> I understand you like pie. I'm telling you, you don't even eat the pies that you just said you I've love. eaten those pies. You ain't never eaten one of those pies in your friggin' life. <laughs> Why would I lie about that? I don't know, because it makes you feel southern and cultured. Anyone can say You think I care pie. about that? You I think do. I care about being cultured? I do. You know I don't care about that. I Come on, man. Wait, you're... Oh, it's like, yeah, sure, block that dude. I'm gonna buy seven pumpkin pies a day, and, sure, and then you'll show up. Yeah, okay, do that. Buy seven pumpkin pies. <laughs> and tomorrow we'll have a pumpkin pie stream where Michael eats seven pumpkin pies. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Just take the whole pie. How many, how many do you think you can get through? 
Realistically, probably like two. Two pies? Actually, I'd probably get sick by then. Two whole pies? Yeah. Does IV pie count? I don't think so. With Coop Whip? <laughs> Coop Whip? I love Coop Whip. He does love some Coop Whip. Look, now we can't draw fourth land to save our life. That's. And now they're going to go Witch's Vengeance and kill both of my fairies. So... This, is a, this game is pretty easy to draw out. Yeah, Frank, have you ever thought about making me a pecan pie or a pumpkin pie? God, you're so selfish. No, I've never thought of that. What's your favorite pie? I don't know, some kind of delicious fruit pie. It just depends on the mood. Yeah, like I like blueberry, I like apple, I like cherry. I like peach. I don't actually care. I think they're all like on the same level to me. I just like the variety of like... Of those different fruit pies? Like, I'll eat any of those pies. I'm a pie eater, man. I'll eat some pies. I'm a pie I also like, I, I like chocolate silk pie. Oh, that's good. I like key lime pie. Those are like my two non-fruit uh, pies, I would say. Two pies and 64 nugs. Get that Twitch support wow. going. I'm in for a saw buck. What is a sawbuck? Is that some kind of is that some kind of civil war shit? Dutch apples the best there is. Is that kind of with the crumbly top? You got a crumbly top. I like the crumbly top. Oh my god, that's really obnoxious. I like the crumb. Wait, did you bounce my tutu? Fascinating. My cold bees are just burning at my cold bees. My cold bees, my cold bees, yeah. He's got my cold sad bees. He's got bees in his mouth. My cold bees have my cold He's got bees, bees in his mouth. My cold bees. How is key lime non fruit? Um, that's a good question. It's not a traditional fruit pie. You know what I'm saying? Like, When I think of fruit, I think of like cobblery pies. It's not like there's actual limes in key lime pie. You don't take actual pieces of lime, you just take the juice. Take that lime juice. Take it a juice. You should do a stream tomorrow with seven pies on standby and Mike eats one for each dwarf you, you draft. That's a good idea. And then if, if I don't draft seven, then we just get backup pies. Sure. When I'm eating a delicious pie, I like a tall glass of milk with a puppy to wash it down. Milk? Did you say milk? What did you say? Milk with a puppy. Mm -hmm. That was a two for one? What kind of keys do you use in your pies? Uh, how do you how do you classify keys? Oh, boy. I guess we're, I'm gonna block here. I'm not taking six here. That seems terrible. Michael Bees. He lives in the trees. <laughs> you like that song? Yeah, man, it's great. Thank you, Michael B. From the tree. Give me a mountain. This is I now I actually want a mountain. Sure. Do I just play both of those? I want to joust this guy and just go bonk him. So what is this? Five, six? Yeah, let's just joust you. Put you to four. So now we have a dwarf and a barge. I'll donate a pie. Do you guys have Marie calendars or Polly's? But we do have Marie calendars. We'd probably just go to Publix and get uh, a fresh baked pie, though. That would be my... Joke's on you, I got dwarfs for days. Oh. Cool. I did not say please, you're right. McDonald's has pies. Well, they have pie pockets. Pie pockets!
This should kill you theoretically. What's a pie pocket? Oh, they do have pie pockets. They're like hot pockets, but with pie. Mm. Alright, now True Love's Kiss is coming in because I didn't see uh, their charm sleep. Oh, they saw a charm sleep, but then they also saw So Tiny, so I imagine they have another one somewhere. Fling could also be good for those creatures. Click that link. Click that link. What is this, a key website? Double-sided key, four-sided key, transponder key, dimple key, paracentric key, skeleton key, abloy key, tub tubular key. That's a lot of keys. I don't know why I opened that. What did I put in? Did I put in this fling? I don't think so. To learn about key types. That's a good point. I guess that is literally exactly why I did it. Oh, we're keeping this for sure. They have two discard spells in their deck? That's interesting. Here's one of them. They're going to two for one themselves? That's so weird. What are you doing, man? You messing with that curtain? Yeah. What kind of pies are we going to get for your seven pie challenge? We're um, we're not we're not gonna do that. Oh, we're hundred percent doing it. We're going to Publix right after this. You think I want to eat? Seven Thank pies, you. Man? I think you're gonna try. Oh, Jake, thanks so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. Time to take the baby out of the. Oh, what? What did they exile? An island? Man, I don't even know if I want to eat one pie. Why not? Have pie? you ever had a pie? They're fucking delicious. Dude. A whole pie. What if people in Twitch pay you to eat those pies? Oh, then I'm I'm done. You're done, you're dead. That means I'm in. Oh. I don't, this card's crazy to me. It's just two for one yourself, right? You choose an online card. If a non-black card is exiled this way, exile a card from your hand. So, like, they choose a non-black card and they just have to exile the island, too. So there's two for one themselves? That's so weird. Can Mike wear a pork pie hat while eating pies? I don't know what that is. You know what a pork pie hat is? No. How long have you played Fallout, man? It's also a Heisenberg hat. Hmm. 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 Well, that was a good draw. How much to donate to put him in a diabetic coma? Can we bake Mike into a pie on stream, or is it against the terms? Of, it might be against terms of service sure they have one card in their hand what if he's already dead god one can only hope you know <laughs> this is great because if we get any future seven dwarfs this guy can start attacking I guess if he's already dead, we can probably put him in a pie. I don't see a problem with that. Uh, that guy doesn't fly, but he looks the hell like... hell does that thing do? It's a 5-5. Five, five, you get to scry, too. They put one on top, one on bottom. Sure. Well, that guy's rough. What if he was born in a pie? Hmm. I was born in a pie once. Were you? Just once, man. Dead Mike Pie is not a big seller from what I remember. That's true. A live Mike pie is also not a big seller. Neither of these pies are really uh, flying off the shelves. What are you doing? You scratching your eyes out? There was a hair. There was a hair. Mm -hmm. Mike's hair is everywhere. Screaming in fidelity. Remember this song? This no. dashboard. You don't remember this dashboard confessional song? No, there are two emo for me, okay? Wow, dude. I mean, they're not now, but they were back in the Bruh. day. Bruh. That was two HXC, bro. Wow. You count this? No? You take eight? I got a big seller for dead Mike Pot. Jesus. 
It's getting really dark here. Put him in the dead Mike cellar. They're going to two here? Oh, no, I guess they have some kind of bullshit. Sure, you got it. Baked into a pizzle. You got an itchy eye here? Mike used to make money at shows from all that change you picked up. Oh, nice reference. What's that? What is that? A, is that a reference? Yeah, because it's like a type of hardcore dance that looks like you're picking up change. <laughs> That's actually pretty funny. Oh, Jesus. Dwarf him. Dwarf him and scorf him. You ever heard of Dwarf him and scorf him? Yeah, man. Same. Yeah, I used to be a real HXC guy. I mean, I still listen to it occasionally, but... Used to skank a lot? No, that's that's a different <laughs> one. Yeah, I bet you were a big fat skanker. You're a big fat skank. Wow, that's that's not the same at all, and I think you know that, that it's hurtful to say that to me. Okay. You got it, Dr. Reeve Soul. Look at that, like, card, discard, discard, removal, removal, removal. Those are the only things they've played. Alright, I'm going to do this. You ready? Boop, boop. Can I kill you? I can kill you. You have died. That's a good song. Thank you, my dude. Confession, I love Skanka. Jake, that does not surprise me at all, dude. You you remind me of the most ska dude I've ever met. Wow. Wow what? I just said wow. Jake reminds me, Jake, Jake, I would not be, if you had a pair of like checkered vans, I would not be surprised. <laughs> I was actually just going to mention that. To be fair, I used to own a pair of checkered vans. Of course you did. Of course you did, Michael. They all did. I <laughs> think he did Victory, and then he did a Hunter as well. Vic Troy? Huh. Why does it say Vic Troy instead of Victory? Huh. I don't even know who that is. Game Attack? I don't even know who that is. Do you know who that is? Nope. They can't even spell. Remember our ska band that only covers the national? Yeah, that that band was great, dude. We should really get them back together. A ska band that only covers the national? Yeah. Oh, that's interesting. That's what we are. That's our band. What was the name of the band? The Ska National. Wow. Really putting it putting it on the nose there, huh? I put you on the nose. It's a meme from another streamer. <laughs> Doubt it. Wow. We just wow. Good game. One seven dwarves. What did they did they mulligan to something crazy? They obviously didn't. They kept a one laner. They mulligan to five. All right. Well. Oh, they mulled the five. Wow. Oof. Oof. I mean, I'm just gonna submit. I don't. I I saw one island. So. But I don't. Our opponent. I hear you, my dude. It is Wednesday, my dudes. You know my biggest complaint with all the Indian food I get is? It's never salted enough. Really? I always want to put a little more salt in there. I'm like, give me a little more salt. Well, luckily they provide salt at the tables. Or at my house. I can have it at my house That's as well. too. What? That too. That's not what you just... <laughs> That's too. That's too. I'm going to tap this guy now. So uh, That's too. Can... Yeah, they might have played Oko there. Oh, no, they're still gonna... Okay, they didn't. That's cool. I didn't get a second white source. I didn't want one anyway. You got a weird definition of cool. <laughs> he said it was cool, but it was actually really uncool. Huh. Wow, that was a nice uh, turn, turn four play there. Yep, another... Another, another one of those, huh? All right. God, you think we didn't have like, I don't know, 12, two and three drops in our deck. 
Yep, yeah, guess I'll take eight. Wow, this game is just as bad as the first one. Only, uh... You know, it just took longer for us to get our ass kicked. Yep, cool. Alright, so... That was a fun game. I had a good time. Everybody fought hard. Do 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 Maybe this last game will be a real game. I have my doubts. Literal six, six three drops, and four two drops that we could have played there. I guess Ardenvale Tactician was an option because we couldn't hit a second white source, but. Okay, let's try this. Seems okay. I think the blue green deck is actually very, very good. I'm a big fan of it. Of course you are. What does that mean? Typical. How dare you? I think it's just better in hand. Especially when they have two Marileaf uh, Tapper, Tapper Ladies. And a Tome Raider that we've seen, so... Mike being colorist. It's true. Mysterious Pathlighter. All right. Or planes. Either one's good. Dun, 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 wow. <laughs> wow. You got it. Got him. Well, at least we have... Idyllic Grange to make this a 4-3. That seems good. Until they fell the pheasant it. Oh, it's a big fat snapper boy. Snapper boy. That's good. It is very good. Second red would be nice, but again, I mean, we only have one of each color in any given matchup. The After you sideboard... Uh, you go from having 16 of one mana and, and one of the other to, to just they reverse it. So then you only get the... You only get one of each color per match, I think. That's how magic works, right? Yeah. I don't know. I'm no expert. That's the impression that I get. <laughs> Have you ever felt close to my girl be you're feeling close to put some hair? Have you ever felt close to Michael B? No! I never had to Michael B. But I know Michael B. has. Hey, they killed your thing. Of course they did. Why wouldn't they? <laughs> oh, Jesus. Can we change his name to Pikeleby? Perhaps. <sighs> sure. to Michael B but I know Michael B has Are you falling asleep? Hmm? Are you literally falling asleep? Maybe Are you are you being serious? I'm always falling asleep man every minute of every day You joke but I think you're actually being serious right now 
Oh good, this guy doesn't untap. Can you explain the process of Michael being? Hmm. Uh, it's being in a constant Michael being in a constant state of of tiredness. I guess we're dead. Yeah, this match was actually horrendous. I uh, really one sided each match. Yeah, it was really not fun at any point. Unfortunately, and unfortunately because it's a. Uh, league you don't get anything for going one two which i guess is fine i guess i don't deserve it but kind of unbelievably have not drawn a single second red source oh you're just gonna counter sure fantastic why wouldn't you have a didn't you didn't say please the perfect mana thank you guys for watching slam those like and subscribe buttons feel free to dislike this as well if you just uh didn't have a good time like me, and uh, I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Really appreciate the support. I guess that's all I got. All have right. Have a good day. Have a good day.